hello guys welcome back to my channel pivot and inquisition so today we are going to have a look on a very important question which is not only my favorite but also important from examiner's point of view as well so let's have a look the question says two very small identical circular loop one and two are carrying an equal amount of current i are being placed vertically with respect to the plane of a paper with their geographical axis that is being perpendicular to each other find the magnitude as well as the direction of net magnetic field produced at o so since this figure has already been given in the question and point o is already mentioned and loop one and loop two that is loop circular loop one and the circular two Two where I am equal amount of current is being flowing through both, having the radius r and x is the amount of distance from center of the loop to the at the position O. So this is already been given. What do we need to find? We need to find uh, we need to find the um, magnitude and the net magnetic direction, magnetic field direction at point O. So since we know this is a loop and this is at the this point O is at the axial position of the loop so we are going to use the same formula that we have used in the derivation that is through that we have derived through a long derivation of a magnetic field at the axial position and the formula that is being uh, that comes out after that derivation was mu naught by 4 pi is equal into 2 uh, pi i a square by x square plus a square k power 3 by 2 where x square plus a square is the distance over here like if you use a pythagoras theorem that is x square plus a square k power 3 by 2 that is we have derived from the derivation similarly the value of b2 will be same and the net magnetic field that is will be that will be in this direction will be b net will be equal to b1 square plus b2 square the value of p1 is already given the value of v2 is also already given what we need to do we just need to substitute these values in this so we have substituted that mu naught by 4 pi 2 pi r i is a square by x square plus a square k power 3 by 2 whole k power 3 so this will be common so we will take it as twice and will this will square will cancel out with this and we get the value as 2 root 2 and everything will remain same just root 2 is being added and this is the way through this we have to solve this question this is very easy question this is actually a previous year question so do practice this by writing it yourself and you have liked this video don't forget to share it with your friends so that everyone can get help through it and if you like this video don't forget to subscribe my channel because in my channel you are going to get all the new all the new and important question of pcm along with their solution isn't it very good so do subscribe it so we'll meet you in next video bye bye